जॉय जगन्नाथ मिस्टर राज चेंगप्पा डिस्टिंग्विश गेस्ट लेडीज एंड जेंटलमैन समस्तों को नमस्कार फर्स्ट आई वुड लाइक टू अपॉलोजाइज फॉर बीइंग सो लेट एंड आई थैंक द इंडिया टुडे ग्रुप फॉर ऑर्गेनाइजिंग स्टेट ऑफ द स्टेट ऑफ द स्टेट कॉन्क्लेव उड़ीसा 2024 it gives me great pleasure that today we are discussing uh, our remarkable transformation celebrating success in multiple fields than dwelling on the pains of the past many devastating natural disasters tested our resilience but through timely preparations and swift action we emerge stronger from a state of helplessness and despondency in the face of vagaries of nature we stood stronger and showed the world how to save lives saving lives have been our guiding principle during covid 2 apart from saving lives across the risa we supplied oxygen a necessary component for covid to various states saving lives across the country we have witnessed remarkable uh, transformation across every sphere from almost zero investment two decades ago we have emerged as a favorite destination for investment <clears throat> apart from emerging as a prime destination for manufacturing we are attracting investment in several frontiers technologies in, including semiconductors today today odisha is the aluminum capital of south asia and the steel hub of the country two decades ago when i assumed charge odisha was a was in a severe financial mess now we are known across the country for our excellence in fiscal management two decades ago odisha evoked a big picture of abject poverty and malnutrition kbk regions were glamorized in the media as a postcard of poverty and malnutrition but now this region is scaling new peaks of development every day emerging as a rice bowl of the country we have managed to reduce multiple dimensional poverty in odisha by 48% in the last decade alone more <clears throat> more than 1 crore people escape poverty during this period i'd like to explain that when we took office more than 20 years ago odisha had 70% 70% of its population living under the poverty line poverty line now only 10% of that population lives under the poverty line which we are still fighting to redress from a non-existent player in the sports ecosystem odisha has emerged as a model in sports development we are building an enviable sports ecosystem in the country while our national hockey teams reached the podium after more than four decades in the olympics odisha also passed in the glory of the nation with its partnership today odisha has emerged as a unique model in women's empowerment after empowering our women under mission shakti we are embarking on a new journey to make them entrepreneurs our party is one of the pioneers in women's empowerment reserving one third seats for women in the 2009 lok sabha 
elections. More than 50% of women are getting elected to grassroots democratic institutions. With the Biju Swasti Kalyan Yojana, we have ensured that even the poorest person is not scared by the cost of treatment, which is made available to everyone. Our transformed classrooms with modern facilities have added wings to the dreams of future citizens and encourage them to dream big. When we embarked on the journey of transformation, we made people as partners in progress. Banking on the principles of 5T, our singular vision is a new Orissa, an empowered Orissa. Our transformative journey is a journey of empowerment for each and every individual in Orissa. Today, as we stand at the cusp of a new era, let us recommit ourselves to building a new Orissa by 2036. That will be the guiding light to the entire nation on empowerment. Bande Utkal Janini. Thank you, Chief Minister, for that very succinct, you've uh, kept to form, but brilliantly uh, enumerated your, uh, the, the transformation that you've brought uh, to the state. I particularly like the words that you use, that people are a partner to the progress. It's not that they're isolated. You have taken them along at every step and ensured the transformation from one of the poorest states in the country to one of the most progressive and developed states that are happening. Let's give the Chief Minister a very warm round of applause for that, sir. And uh, we just have a small token of appreciation, sir, which we'd like to present to you. Um, it just could bring some memories back to you, sir.